Hello friends, this is a fresh install Vista CP on a CentOS 7 server and just after installing I'm getting a weird problem that uh, whenever I'm trying to open webmail you can see I'm clicking main tab and then I'm trying to open webmail from here so it's IP slash webmail I'm getting this error message file not found the requested resource was not found please contact your server with data so why this is happening on a fresh install Vista CP and how we can fix this to solve this let us log in to our server via SSH so login as root and okay, password okay so I am logged in as root here so first let us check uh, the error message error log of round cube so we can see the error log of round cube here slash var slash log slash round cube mail so cd and here you can see this error log so, so let's see what is log error so we can see here these are the error message and this says PHP error error road loading template for login in slash user slash sales slash round cube main slash program slash includes online 804 so this seems that there is some problem with the template file or the skin file of round cube so let us see what skins we have on our server installed with round cube so go to slash user slash sales slash round cube mail slash skin and we can see that we have one skin elastic okay now let us go to our configuration file now let us check in the configuration file of round cube so go to cd slash etc slash round cube main and here we have this config dot inc inc dot php file this is the configuration file so let us open this file in nano editor so nano config dot inc dot php and search for skin configuration line so let's check where this line is okay this is the last line this is config skin is called to laddie but we don't have any skin named laddie instead we have elastic so i'm going to come in this line and i'm going to add Elastic E L A S T I C. Okay, E L A S T I C and save this phone and exit. Okay, that's it. I think now let us refresh our webmail page, and now you can see this is working. Now we are getting the login page of front cube so this is how we can fix this we just need to change the skin name in the configuration file of front cube thank you